to TxDOT's reasons for demanding that work be stopped on the cable stay portion of the new Harbor Bridge. That's the portion of the bridge that goes over the water and according to TxDOT, it is at risk of collapsing should work continue. TxDOT now being more specific with some of their concerns, talking about design deficiencies. The word collapse is not a good word. The word collapse means we need to really know about the public safety. That was Representative Todd Hunter. He and other state leaders are demanding transparency when it comes to what exactly is going on. That response comes after a letter from TxDOT sent to the developers, the bridge flat uh, of the bridge, rather the Flatiron Drake Dragados uh, says that if work on the New Harbor Bridge had continued without any design changes, chances are the bridge would, quote, collapse under certain load conditions. Now, the letter was sent to the developers back on July 15th. That's the same day that we brought you news that work had been halted. And since that day, we've been asking both Flatiron and TxDOT to share the reasons for the halt it took them nearly three weeks to finally disclose the shocking concerns that they have. TxDOT goes on to say that the risk could bring, quote, dangers to persons or property related to the design deficiencies. State representatives have joined 3 News in looking for answers to the problems with the bridge. I'm always concerned about delay uh, it, because you keep moving the goalpost here. And the idea is get the information out so we can have a real good timeline. And that is what we need to build from. So delay does concern me because we sure do go through a lot of hurricane seasons. TxDOT adds, quote, we cannot and will not compromise on safety. An independent review of the bridge's design by the group International Bridge Technologies found five areas of concern. Those include inadequate capacity of the pylon drilled shafts and deficiencies in footing caps that led to the report that the bridge would collapse under certain load conditions. Now, Corpus Christi Mayor Paulette Wajardo tonight telling 3 News that safety is our most important concern. If the final design is not safe, then TxDOT and our Texas state delegation need to provide the necessary oversight to ensure public safety. Once again, developer Flatiron Dragados has had no comment since TxDOT halted construction now nearly three weeks ago. Now to the other 